Good morning, good afternoon and good evening everyone. I hope you all must be doing good. So today I have a POCO M3 and today I will show how to convert POCO M3 from any region ROM to another region ROM to get a me dialer and me SMS application. For example, I am having global ROM on my POCO M3 and global ROM comes with the Google dialer and Google messaging application. But the Indonesia ROM is having me dialer and me SMS application. So without unlocking bootloader, I am going to convert my POCO M3 from global ROM to Indonesian ROM and I will get me dialer and me SMS application and things will be working absolutely fine. Yes. So do not forget to subscribe my channel by clicking the red color subscribe button and uh, click the bell icon select all. Thank you for doing that. Now, moving further, uh, let me inform that this procedure is not required to unlock the bootloader and in case if someone is having an unlock bootloader, still you can follow this method. This method is absolutely working perfectly on lock bootloader and on unlock bootloader. Now, what were things that we have to do to proceed this procedure? Yes, we need to download two recovery ROM files and that must be full recovery ROM file. One file, the one you have on your mobile phone. I mean to say, if I go to about phone, right now currently my set is on MIUI 12.5.5 and Android 11, yes. Now doesn't matter if your set is 12.5.1, if in case, if whatever version you see here and you see in the brackets, if you see MI, which means that you have a global ROM. And if you see TW, which means that you have Taiwan. And if you see IN, MI, instead of MI, IN stands for India. So you are having India region ROM. Now you have to check this, these, uh, the, the codes in the brackets and then you need to download current version install already on your POCO M3 or uh, uh, and it must be full recovery ROM file and the another full recovery ROM file must be other region ROM which you want to flash or which you want to convert. I mean to say like for example today I am going to download Indonesia ROM. So you don't need to use computer you can download both ROM file on your mobile phone. First of all connect internet on your mobile phone then uh, open your browser link is provided in my video description click the link this website will get open scroll down and come down here is the big list of uh, poco m3 rom files now first of all i am having in uh, the rom file installed already on my mobile phone that is the global poco m3 global stable recovery yes now moving forward and version just I have this version 12.5.5. Now I will move forward further and here you can see the download section. Click the download button. So this website is providing the things for free. So definitely you will see ads. Just turn the ads off and the next page will get open. Now scroll down and definitely you will see the details of the ROM file. Now you need to check the version 12.5.5. Yes, I have uh, installed already this uh, version and you need to check the type recovery. Yes, do not download fast boot file. Do, you have to download the recovery file. Now scroll down and type uh, tap full ROM here, the blue color download section and the downloading will get start. Uh, tapping the details and the ROM file is started downloading. I will pause this file because I have already downloaded the file, this file. Now we'll go back to the page where the list of ROMs were available. Yes, this is the website, the first website, the ads are coming, uh, just uh, turn it off. Now, if you are going for the Indonesia version to get me dialer, then uh, tap the Indonesian version or if you want to go for Taiwan also having me dialer then go for the Taiwan but it must be a full recovery ROM file. So for example I will download Indonesia ROM POCO M3 Indonesia the first one 
and currently whatever version is available download it moving further and we'll tap download section then scroll down and check the version yes whatever current version available for indonesia just uh, check the type recovery it must be recovery now if you see here two options one is full rom and one is incremental update do not tap the incremental update just tap the full rom again we need full rom for this procedure done and the rom file started downloading right i will post this file too because already have these two files now let me go to file manager to show that we'll go to storage then the rom files both are in download folder here are the both files that i have already download it on my mobile phone right minimize this file manager now just check the internet must be connected on your mobile phone now tap settings starting the procedure to convert poco m3 well let me inform you that this procedure will not erase a data but in case this is xiaomi and i can't guarantee that the data will remains there so better to save your important data whatever the pictures and whatever videos you have because the set may ask for factory data reset so the data will get erased check the battery should be charged to minimum 50 to 60 percent and now tap settings then tap about phone and tap the MIUI version. It will uh, check the updates. Now tap this big 12 number for seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Additional updates feature are on. Tap three dots, then tap choose update package. And the set will go automatically to file manager. Tap the download folder and select the current install ROM on your mobile phone. And that, uh, that uh, for example, I'm having 12.5.5. I will tap to select the global ROM file, then tap OK. The procedure will start. Just wait for it. Now, definitely, when you see this uh, pop up window, reboot and update, the set will convert from global to Indonesian ROM. In case if any Xiaomi device shows only updates, not reboot, then this method will not work. Now, minimize this window and tap the file manager to open it. Then go to storage and tap download folder. Tap OK. Yes. Now, here is the most important thing that we have to do. Press and tap the global ROM. The first one we select for the flashing, like the currently I am having. T press and tap. It will be selected. Then tap more. Then tap rename. And tap once. Then tap press and tap once again. So the file will get selected, but the window didn't open. So tap once again. And yes, now you will see select all, cut and copy. Tap select all, then tap copy. The file name is copied now. Now the ZIP, if you see the cursor is blinking at the end of the extension file name ZIP. Erase ZIP and type BAK. We have to change the global ROM, the one already installed on POCO M3 from ZIP to BAK. Now tap OK and tap OK once again and the file name the extension is got changed now now is it is time to rename the uh, indonesian rom file press and tap the indonesian rom file it will get selected then tap more tap rename and erase everything do not leave a single alphabet or dot erase everything then press and tap in this blank window the other window will pop up you will see paste tap paste OK, it's gone. Tap again, tap paste and the file name that way you copied earlier will get paste on this window. Then tap OK. And the Indonesia ROM file, which were having a name of 12.5.4 uh, is got changed from 12.5.4 to 12.5.5. Now minimize this file manager and tap recent app and you will see updater window here tap to bring the updater window on your mobile phone and tap reboot and update now the procedure will start and wait for it it will take around one or two minutes 
Now here is the thing that I want to show. The set will start updating. If you see the numbers are uh, coming and it will get stuck at uh, somewhere like uh, yes 0 0.67 then it will direct jump to 8.36 something like that. When you see this thing it means this procedure is perfectly working on the mobile phone. Now wait for it. Let the flashing complete. Let the updating complete. Then we will continue. Finally the updating procedure got completed and maybe set required to boot into MIUI recovery for factory data reset or maybe it will start booting to Indonesia ROM. Let's see. Okay finally set started booting into Indonesia ROM. After uh, when the, the first boot completed and uh, unlocking the screen you will see missing icons here. The dialer and the SMS application uh, icons are missing. Now tap settings and go to apps. Then uh, tap manage apps and search for L A U. Poco launcher will appear. Tap on it then tap clear data. Tap clear all data, tap OK and done, go back and definitely now you will see the missing icons will come back. Now we got the me dialer here, yes and if I go further, we got the call recording feature now and also we got me SMS applications. Now this is how to convert POCO M3 from global to another region ROM like Indonesia or Taiwan to get the Mi Dialer and Mi SMS application. The updating procedure is done and we got the Indonesian ROM. If you are having a lock bootloader, yes you can still do it or in case if you are a flashaholic, you are having an unlock bootloader, still you can proceed this procedure. The data remains there, data didn't uh, get erased and uh, set is converted now. Thank you. I hope you got helped by this video. Do not forget to like the video, share it with others, subscribe my channel and we'll see you again in my next video. Take a good care of yourself. We'll see you again. Until then, goodbye.